if you would like to enter to win a Force FX lightsaber, all you have to do is subscribe to the YouTube channel, like the video, and post in the comments below what your all-time favorite lightsaber is. More information has been revealed to us through the novelization for Star Wars The Last Jedi, but not just information from this film alone, as things are explained to us even further through the events that transpired in The Force Awakens. Within the book, there is more detail on the injuries inflicted on Kylo Ren at the end of The Force Awakens, including the fact that Kylo was unable to walk following his duel with Rey, and details how exactly Kylo survived such a devastating attack by Chewbacca's weapon, the Bowcaster. In the Last Jedi novelization, there are two feats that Kylo nearly accomplishes that truly speak to his raw power in the Force. The first of which happens just as he decides not to fire upon his mother in the Resistance cruiser, Leia Organa. As the missiles from the ties behind Kylo fire upon his mother Leia, Kylo comments that had he not been so surprised, he would have reached out with the Force and stopped the missiles, just as we have seen Darth Vader do several times in canon Star Wars comics. The novel explains that Kylo would have attempted to make the missiles miss, or even stop them in their tracks by using the Force, but ultimately that he was caught off guard due to the mental connection he briefly shared with his mother. More than just choosing not to fire on Leia, Kylo would have actually attempted to save her life directly in front of all of the First Order. It was also revealed to us in the novelization that something similar happened on Starkiller Base, but that Kylo was just able to make a large enough impact to save his life. After killing his father Han Solo, Chewbacca fires his bowcaster at the young dark side warrior, and at the last moment, without lifting his arm, Kylo is able to slow and alter the path of the blaster bolt just enough to save his own life. Although Kylo's manipulation is not enough to stop the attack from connecting, he is able to slow it down enough that it does far less damage than it normally would have, again saving his life. These are just two feats that are expanded upon in the novel for The Last Jedi, and how Kylo used the Force to attempt to stop two projectiles at different moments, but in the end, ultimately failed. I find this revelation very, very compelling though, as Kylo directly attempts to intervene before Leia is shot at. This shows that unlike his father, Han Solo, Kylo is unable to kill his mother, and more than this, unable to let others kill her as well. This also speaks to Kylo Ren's power in the Force, as at least in his mind, he is powerful enough to stop two projectiles from firing upon his mother within the vacuum of space. But leave your thoughts on this moment between Kylo Ren, Leia, and the TIE Fighters in the comment section down below, and what do you think of Kylo's choice to attempt to save his mother? Stay tuned on the channel for more Last Jedi videos will follow because of the novelization. Again, don't forget to enter the lightsaber giveaway. May the Force be with you, and have a great day.